was all about the AirPods generation That's actually two. what happens when you don't customize anything about that in the I settings. My dad. <laughs> I control my dad with this. <laughs> Welcome to a Hunt Toys review. Hey guys! Welcome back to a Hunt Toys review. It's me, a Han here. Today, I'm going to be reviewing the AirPods Generation 2. Woohoo! I may be small, but I'm definitely ready to review the AirPods Generation 2. Let's go! Woohoo! Let's open this up. But before we do that, make sure to subscribe to our channel. If you like AirPods, then you're sure to love this video. Show us your love on AirPods by commenting down below and liking this video. You have five seconds starting now. Five, four, three, two, one, done. This is the wireless charging case version. Are you excited to see? Coming off at the top. Ta-da! Just kidding. There's a few more layers to go through. So as you can see, there's like the same like type of flap that it's usually in iPhones and iPads. So we got to take that off. Voila! We've got the wireless charging case. AirPods don't come with the Apple stickers like the iPhones and iPads do. Instead, they just come with these papers. I'm not, I'm not going to really look through them. They look like the instructions, I think. So we don't really need them. So we'll put those aside to this way. And these are the AirPods. And the inside of the charging case are the AirPods. So let's gently take them out because they're new. Brand new. Let's take them out. So under the charging case, if you take this flap, flap out, under there, we've got the charging cable so wire. So this is the wire where you charge the case. And then if you put the AirPods in, it will charge the AirPods. So we don't really need the wire right now. And let's take a look at the AirPods themselves. So first what we got to do is we have to take this wrap off, which I'm pretty sure is in tape. Well, it's just like, it's like sticky gum underneath it. I'm going to take that out gently. There we go. And this way. I think there's something at the top that we have to bend with. Unless. I can't get it off. Then you have to pull these side flaps. Like that. And then you can take it out. Pretty this much. is the charging case. So. Nothing's really changed from the AirPods 1 and the AirPod and the AirPods the second generation. A few little tweaks that have changed are that the LED light in the AirPods the tiny one for, so in the AirPods 1 it used to be inside like right in the middle right here but now it's outside right here so you can check at the charging state like you can take a sneak peek at, peek at it instead of opening the case up and as you can see, we've got the AirPods themselves right here. And so as you can see, when you open it up, the, the LED light starts flashing white. And then right here are the AirPods themselves. So let's take a look at them by taking them out one by one carefully. So they've actually got letters on them to mark which one's left and which one's right. Right here, you can see that there's an R on this one for right. And there's an L on this one to mark that it's for the left ear. So let's set these, set these down. And the case is really, where you put the AirPods, it's really shallow. If you can see at the very bottom of the holders for the AirPods, you can kind of see like two like golden, like small holes. That's where the AirPods charge from the bottom, right there, if you can see them. And then another thing is that, so when you close them, in the AirPods 1, if you do that side to side, it used to make a clicking sound. But in the AirPods 2, they changed that, Apple changed that, and then it doesn't make that clicking sound anymore. And also, 
If you might be wondering what this button is right here. If you might be wondering what this button on the back of the case is for. So that button is actually, so if you don't have an iPhone and you have like an Android phone. So what you could do is you could uh, put the case next to the your Android phone and hold this button. And, it, and the AirPods too will actually work. For Android devices, not just Apple. It'll, it'll work for Android devices. And it'll pop up on your screen to set up the AirPods. And that's really cool because, in, because it's really unusual that you can use a different brand's product and use them on, and like, if you're using Apple's products on a, on a Samsung phone. Now let's figure out how to pair it to the iPhone right here. And so first what you got to do is open up the AirPods case and it, and you've got to put back the AirPods into their case. And it's actually magnetic when you put them back in. Like you can feel the magnetic force pushing in. Now I've put the AirPods back in their case and what you got to do is you got to leave them open like this. So I'm going to hold it like first, this. First you got to turn on your Bluetooth for your Android or iPhone. And then you got to put your iPhone next to your AirPods, and then something like that should pop up. And what you gotta click is you gotta click connect. And now they're connecting. So as you can see, it shows the charging of your AirPods and your case. So for the AirPods, we've got 91% charge charged. And for the case, it's 73%. So after that, we have to click done. Now your AirPods are completely paired to your iPhone. It's that simple, guys. There's also a lot of optional features. So one of them is like, when you say, hey Siri, with your AirPods, it automatically turns on Siri on your iPhone. With the new H1 chip, you have more talk time than the AirPods first generation. So that is much, much better. If you double tap on one of the AirPods, it turns on Hey Siri, and you can reduce the volume with that without even like clicking the volume buttons on your iPhone. And the, if you click the other side, double tap it, what happens is you can use, if you're watching like a video, YouTube video, you can play and pause it. Now, I'm gonna do a quality test. So I'll take the AirPods out one by one. And this is actually just the second time I'm taking the AirPods out. Close that up, put it aside like that. And so let's see the labels. So I can hear something guys. I can hear whatever the iPhone's playing. Ooh, I hear music. I think I know what song this is It's for. Happier. It's Happier by Marshmallow. I love this song. It's probably my favorite song. And me um, too. Mm -hmm. And me too. You too, Arjun? Yeah. Where are you? I don't see you. Here. Where? Here. You're not in the video. Here. You're, yeah, but you're not in the video. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> I love this song. I can hear it a million times. Been only for a minute. Want to sing along? Just don't feel right. Me. Wait, I want to see which one's pause and play. What the heck? It went to the next video for some reason, guys. So that's actually what happens when you don't customize anything about that in the settings. It starts off with your right ear. If you double tap it, it goes to the next video. I want to see what happens if I click double tap my, the, my left ear. And it goes to the video on the, the one you were watching before. And ooh, 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 ooh. I can change this whenever I want. And guess what? I control. <laughs> I control my dad with this. <laughs> this is a trumpet song. So I'm going to customize in the settings later 
and I'm gonna turn one to Hey Siri and the other one to pause and play. Make sure to subscribe to our channel and give this video a big thumbs up. And also, while you're doing that, ring that bell so you don't miss any new updates. Bye! This video was all about the AirPods Generation 2. And for now, I'm signing off. See you later, folks.